Hey guys, what's up? In today's video, we're going to Camp Kikiwaka. Kikiwaka! Okay, this is a cult. Taxi! No worries, he'll stay for a while. So, our first cast member is Peyton List, who played sweet and fashionable Emma Ross. Well, she looks a bit more mature, especially with makeup. That's not a huge change, though. Gorgeous then and gorgeous now. And that's, of course, her twin brother, Spencer. He guest appeared in one episode. You and Eric kind of look alike. We do, do not. not. <laughs> but back to Peyton. Since the show, she's been in a few smaller movies and series like Light as a Feather and Cobra Kai. She's also pursuing a music career. For now, she's released three singles. You can find them on YouTube. <laughs> and fun fact about Peyton from Peyton herself. One kid recently, he asked me to sign his forehead, and that was weird. LOL. <laughs> OMG. Yes, fans can be weird. Then we have another member of the Ross family, Robbie, played by the one and only Karan Brar. <laughs> yes, there is a change here, and his facial hair makes a lot of difference. I'd say he's more manly now. Looks very good. Your geek is on fleek. <laughs> and a few words about work. Karan starred recently in Disney's Stargirl and as a voice actor in a few animated series. What's super intriguing is one of his upcoming movies called Hubie Halloween with Adam Sandler. I was shocked when I saw the cast. Brace yourself. Karan Brar, Peyton List, Kevin Quinn, China Ann McClain, Bradley Stephen Perry, Paris Bellaret, Kelly Berglund, Lillamar, Amber Frank, Lance Lamb, and on top of that, Noah Schnapp from Stranger Things. That's just crazy. So many Disney and Nick stars. Okay. <laughs> it's probably all cameos, but still very impressive. And one fun fact about Ravi, his full name on the show was Ravi Kupta Balasabrani Nimnim Ross. Whoop. <laughs> Next, Sky Jackson, also known as sassy and mischievous Zuri Ross. So Sky looks older for sure. I wouldn't say she looks 18 though. I think she's one of those lucky people who will just always look younger than their age. Of course, lucky when they're older. I know it can be challenging when you're a kid. I was being bullied in school, mainly for just being short. By the way, she looks gorgeous with this wavy hair. Also, check out her mother. She looks amazing for 45 years old. I'm jealous. Jealous and pretty. You mean petty. That too. <laughs> and career-wise, since she left Bunked after the third season, she worked mostly as a voice actor. Her most recent project is the animated series Dragons Rescue Riders, where she's voicing a dragon named Summer. Well, at least we got here before she could start the fires back up. Oh yeah, and she just graduated high school. I think it was an online ceremony. <laughs> now, fun fact about Sky. Last year, she published a book titled Reach for the Sky, How to Inspire, Empower, and Clap Back. Very impressive. Keep up the good work, Sky. Okay, so there is another guy who's changed a lot. I don't know if you remember Juvie Kid Griff, played by Lincoln Melcher. He's only 16, but it seems like 10 years of difference. Or is it just me? Anyways, I wouldn't recognize him now. Okay, our next camper is Xander McCormick, played by Kevin Quinn. Hey! Ah! Ow, 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 that burns! So has he changed? Nope, he's the same. I guess he was too old in the first place. Anyways, he's always super cute. And what's he been up to all this time? Well, he was mostly working on his music. Last year, he released a debut album called Edge of the World and already got a chance to sing on Winter Jam Tour. Thank you so much, Congrats on that. As for acting, he appeared in a Hallmark movie, a Christmas love story, and a video game, Kingdom Hearts 3, as the voice of Gula, you know, whoever that is. We're also waiting for a musical a week away with Bailey Madison slated for release this year. You can't miss this one, a very talented duo. Now, an interesting fact about Kevin. Music was always his first passion, and he auditioned for season 12 of American Idol. By you. He was 15. 
Okay guys, very short ad. Check out our merch on the Teespring store. We have a lot of beautiful designs. Links in the comments and the video description. Thanks for the support. Now, a few words about Tessa Netting, who played the mean girl of Camp Kikiwaka, Hazel. As you can see, she loves dressing up and changes hairstyles like twice a day. That being said, she hasn't changed that much, just the haircut. Scrolling her Instagram is really fun though. As for work, Tessa's a pretty successful YouTuber. Oh, I'm so excited. Wow. Yes, I empathize. Thanks for 100,000 subs, by the way. Anyway, that's her fiance, Joe, and they are kissing in Hogwarts. Very cool. Gryffindor! Oh, Slytherin! Yes! Now, let's take a moment to appreciate this colorful human being. Nice. Next, Miranda May, better known as cheerful head counselor Lou Hawkhauser. So I'm sure you all know about her fitness transformation. Miranda lost some weight in the last few years and is a big inspiration for the fans. She looks great. Am I the smallest I've ever been? No. Am I happy? Yes. What's interesting, Miranda appeared in 90 episodes of Bump, so she's the only one who survived to the end of the show. Although, I've read that the Ross kids will be back for the last episode, so that would be nice. Anyway, the show ends this year, so we'll soon see what's next for Miranda. I'm on TikTok now. Oh yeah, and she's on TikTok now. There are probably more people on TikTok than not on TikTok. Did you just wink at me? JK! Next comes Nina Liu, who played smart, but a bit uptight, camper Tiffany. Hmm, that's a huge change. Her face is gigantic now. <laughs> okay, that's a joke. Seriously though, her transformation is one of the biggest ones. She looks way more mature. It has been five years. Hope I've had a glow up since then. That's for sure. So fans can watch Nina on YouTube and in the comedy series Sunny Side Up with Nina Sue. Nah, liars. She's also TikToking like crazy. Eat dinner, go on TikTok. I work out, I go on more TikTok and then it's four in the morning. Yeah, her schedule is pretty tight. Now, check out her singing voice. I think it's stunning. Yesterday, I couldn't help but hear. <laughs> She's laughing as he leans over and whispers in her ear. <laughs> and one more thing, a very random fact about Nina. One of my favorite things in the whole world, holding a chicken. I don't know, I used to have chickens when I was younger, but it's just, there's just something about like holding a chicken. Real life chicken girl. What? <laughs> then we have Nathan Arenas, who played Jorge, an energetic kid with attention deficit disorder. Hey dudes, I'm Jorge! Yes, he's also growing super fast. It's a joke with his face app beard, but still, his transformation is huge. And his hair is out of control. <laughs> now, a few words about his work. Nathan guest appeared in many shows since Bump. His biggest role so far is on the series Diary of a Future President. Oh, yeah. Also, he had a TikTok reunion with Nina Liu. Nice. And fun fact about Nathan, but you might have guessed this one. He's a big fan of magic tricks. Oh, yikes. Now, check out the rest of the cast with music, but I don't think these new actors from the third and fourth seasons have changed that much. Or did they? Check it out for yourself. Great, let's do this. 